Hello students welcome back to another session of lesson 2 nationalism in india today we will study about the roulette act the roulette act in 1919 was passed through the imperial legislative council in spite of opposition of the indian members roulette act gave the government enormous power to repress political activities according to this act the political prisoners could be detained in prison for 2 years without any trial gandhi ji decided to oppose it with satyagraha on 6th april 1919 was observed as satyagraha day when people all over the country observed fast and hartal it was the first country wide agitation by gandhi ji it marked the foundation of the non cooperation movement On 10th April the police in Amritsar fired upon a peaceful procession it provoked widespread attack on banks post office and railway station martial law was imposed and general dyer took command now we will study about jallianwala bag massacre which took place on 13th April 1919 to protest against the roulette act and the arrest of the leaders like dr satyapal and dr kichlu when about 20000 people gathered at a meeting in the jallianwala bag in amritsar they were surrounded by general dyer and his army unit which opened in discriminate firing killing thousands of innocent people the impact of jallianwala bag on the indian politics the jallianwala bag massacre had a great impact on the indian politics now the people lost faith in the british rule and took the extreme path of violent struggle to get rid of it mahatma gandhi with the cooperation of the ali brothers mohammad ali and shaukat ali and who spearheaded the khilafat movement he launched his first non cooperation movement in 1920 ad The Jallianwala Bagh massacre had a great significance in the history of India. On the one hand, it hit adversely the honor and prestige of the British government, while on the other hand, it marred permanently the government's re- relation with its subjects. It also helped further in promoting national unity as people belonging to all sections and communities had fallen prey of these atrocities ravindranath tagore returned the knighthood in protest of the incident mahatma gandhi called off the movement when he saw spread of violence students i hope you all have understood this much we will continue this lesson in my next video thanks for watching